Welcome to my dollars and cents online. My name is Ashley and today is a wig review video. I know it's been a minute since I have been with you all, but I am back, back, back. Start 2021. All right. Happy New Year to you all. Let's go ahead and get into what I purchased. Okay. So I purchased from ebonyline.com and I got two units. Um, FYI, my videos are never sponsored. I spent my own money on them and give you honest reviews. Even if it was sponsored, I would still give you honest reviews. So the one on top is the one I'll try on first. This is Angel Face. Um, dang. I open much? But anyway, this is Angel Face LS3006. I got it in the color um, 1B. And this is all curl types from 3B to 4C. It says Taylor Textures, uh, Curls, Kinks, and Co. 100% premium fiber it's from sensational um it's a textured lace wig and it's safe up to 350 to 400 degrees fahrenheit this is the stock card okay 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 look at that baby draw <clears throat> okay Ooh. That lace is um not for me. That's for very bright, very bright and light skinned women. Okay, so we're gonna have to get the Ebon out. Oh, I, I hope I'm not out. Ebon New York Tinted Lace Aerosol Spray in Skin Tone Medium Brown. Um, <clears throat> yeah, most definitely we're gonna have to get that out. Let me show y'all this part though. Yeah, that's the part. You want to look at some of this lace, girl. Okay, they got some curly cues, real long baby hairs, apparently. Um, nothing through there. And definitely can see them knots, of course. How light this is. Um, it definitely has. A light yakky texture. I think they said that, didn't they? I don't know. Y'all will remember better than me, honey. At this point. Hair is shading onto my desk. Yeah. And other stuff, too. Like, God, did y'all... What is going on? What is that? A piece of thread? What? Yeah, baby. Y'all are seeing it right here. Live. They're coming out of it like crazy. I haven't even put this on yet. I haven't brushed it or anything. Just running my fingers through it. Getting a little bit of yankage. Not very much at all. But we get, we're getting a ton of shedding. Um, so, we already have a disappointment there. We already have a con there. Um, let me go ahead and show you all the cap construction. So, it's a lace part, center part. Um, can't flip it to the side or anything like that. You have a comb here and a comb here. At the front, you have the drawstrings, the draw, draw, what? drawstrings, I don't know what's going on. On the back with the comb in the back as well. And it's the breathable mesh, the net, the netting is the cap. Um, the hairline is, I don't know, I'll let y'all be the judge of how this hairline is. It's like they give you about this much of them trying to, um, like, thin it out. And then it's just thick. So, but I'm going to go ahead and um, spray this with my ebon. Cut the lace off and come back with it on, you guys. So, give me a moment. Okay, so this is the unit with all the hair pulled up to the front. All I did was spray my ebon and I um, cut the lace off and just put it on. 
It is snug. I think it's a medium size um, cap. Definitely not, I would say, a big hair friendly. I mean, my head is in there, but like I feel it pressing, gripping my head for sure. Um, at first, I wasn't even sure if I was going to get it on there, but then I had realized um, my hair was in the way. But yeah, so um, <clears throat> look at this curl. Look at the curls, though. It's very, very pretty. I love the feel of it for sure. With that light, 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 uh, light yakky texture. And it comes to right here on oh, me. And it's a steady shade in y'all. Ooh, Lord, what in the world? And I cut no hair. Can't say it was because I cut the lace. You saw that from the beginning, how it was steady coming out, right? Okay, well, it's not stopping. Like, this hair is not attached to this unit, to this cap, if you ask me. Because this right here is just, just now. Because I moved all the hair out the way, and I still have a disc. Like, my disc is back up with hair now. This is quite ridiculous. Um, so I guess it won't last you very, very long. Um, seeing as it's shedding like this. Let me show y'all the back. That's where it comes to. It's pretty though. I'm not gonna like it when it's just that little bit coming up though. I don't think. Mind you all, I cannot see, um, so <clears throat> I'm not going to get into it, into it, because I cannot see. The only thing I can see is I'm looking into the camera, but um, <clears throat> looks like it's cute, though, but so <clears throat> con, major con is the shedding. This unit will not stop shedding, obviously. Um, the second thing that I don't like on this unit, and some units are like this, and I don't know why. Um, I'm trying to think how the other units been sensational as well. I can't really remember if it was or not, but why do they do this at the part? Like, can they have two pieces of lace connected, overlapping on each other that they sew together, I guess, or whatever, and it creates a line in your part. It makes you think, it, it gives the look like, your cap is back or something. But then when you look, it's actually the unit, the lace, the way that they did it. I hate when they do stuff like that. And you can see it is obvious right there. That spot um, is where lace is going across, like overlapping each other. And so um, you're definitely going to have to like use some powder or something on your part to try to conceal that better. Um... And I would also recommend probably gluing this down. Not gluing it, but you know, got to be glue um, gel or either the hairspray. Um, or either probably cut a small V in there or something. I don't know. To me, it's just obvious. And then like, you, I don't know. The lace is just not the greatest. It's not the greatest. And I also don't think it's the softest. Wait a minute, let me see. Oh, yeah, it is. Yeah, it is the soft lace. But, um, yeah, so this is Angel Face in 1B. Let me say the stock card. What other colors does she come in? It says it's ear to ear soft lace. Easy self application can be styled as an updo. Natural look and feel. It says this can be styled as an updo. Shoot, it can barely fit my head, honestly. Like, it's already above. I would have to use the comb, and baby, I ain't trying to do all of that. But it's already coming up above. My hairline back there, like the bottom of my braid trying to slip on out. Um, I'm not sure about this being an updo. But she got a smaller head. And then I don't know how it looks back there for that. But natural look and feel. So it comes in 613, Money Piece Blonde, um, Money Piece Caramel, Caramel. Money piece gold, money piece hazel, and money piece wine. So this is one of the ones without a money piece color. So I think that she's very pretty. She's definitely a look great for it. Like if you're trying to stun on somebody, you know, you got a little event or something you're trying to do, um, then definitely I would consider uh, purchasing this. 
Now, how long this could last, I'm not sure. Probably could last a little bit because of that texture um, that it has, but without it shedding, like, who wants to be walking around with a whole bunch of hair and looking like you own a dog or something? Like, no. So, yeah, um, make your decisions based upon that. But I'm going to go ahead and move on to the next unit. And the next unit that... The next unit I purchased is also by the same Taylor Tashers Curls Kinks and Co. 100% premium fiber, sensational textured lace wig. This is the Elite Babe LS 3005 instead of 3006. And this one is also open and falling out. <laughs> but um, it's the same temperature, same curl types, I believe, 3B to 4C. It's in 1B. Um, it's basically just the shorter version of this. So when you don't want to stun on them and you want to go a little, you know, a little light on them, you know, I mean, every day wear, you know, maybe then, um, you can hit this. But baby, I, I wear the, I rock the, um, long every day. I have no problems with it. No complaints. But I am getting older, y'all, so who knows? I might, uh, flip it up, change it up a little bit and start... Trying to be a little bit more conservative, like I guess. I guess I'm not I'm not conservative when it comes to my hair. I don't know. I, I feel like I am. I don't do too many colors. But since I'm uh, self-employed now fully, <laughs> watch out, baby, because I was looking for some color wigs, honestly. Cause I said, oh, I can't I can't do what I want now. I can stun on them. Say like, what? Like stop playing with. Anyways, so same deal, same type of effect, just shorter, same texture, it feels so good. You have these pretty curls and everything, same lace color. Um, same part, and I believe, same hairline for sure. And this is what I was talking about, about where the um, lace overlaps. And it's bright on your head. And I don't know why they do stuff like that. And I think it's sensational. That I always, I ain't gonna say always, but that does that. And I'm like, what is wrong with y'all? Same baby hairs and everything else. So, you already know what I'm gonna do. Use my Ebb and Tint um, spray to tint the lace. And cut it off and then come back so y'all can see it. Okay, y'all, I forgot. Let's see if it's going to shed like this other one. I'm trying to get all the um, hair tint spray. Well, it's really not for hair. But anyway, I'm trying to get it all out of the hair because I always make a mess because I'd be in a rush and I just do it carelessly because I don't be caring like that. <laughs> it's just, it'll come right out. This one is not shitting. Hold on now because see, I'm feeling some type of way now because why is this one shitting like crazy? When I got a defective one or something, baby, because let me know, let me know what's the um policies on these units when they def when they're defective. That's what I need to know, cause I don't know that. I don't know about that. <laughs> I'll be back, y'all. Okay, y'all. My God, I must say I really do like this unit, though. Like it is so. Pretty. If it wasn't for this shit, and that's the only thing. That's the only con, the thing that you can't fix. Because, of course, you can cover that little part of the lace. But it is so pretty, you all. Like, look at it. Stop playing with me, boo. Who? Let me try on this shorter one because I said it had to be, like, not growing out of who hair? Who, out of who head? Who? Where's, where's not growing out of my scalp, sis? Let me know something. <laughs> I got a feeling that's where that's about to put me. Where this is about to put me. Since that one was a little tight, let me see. It's on the last thing. Let's see how this one fits. Snuggle bug too. Snug. For sure, for sure. Ugh, honey. I can't see y'all, so. Excuse me for being a mess. Let me these loose glasses, honey. Glasses are all coming after these. Just so you know, I have eight pairs of glasses that I ordered. So another glasses video is coming. 
immediately. And man, y'all like it. Now see how I'm putting this on, how it looks. Y'all getting the first look. So y'all tell me. This is it all the way to the front. All of it. Okay. And this is just a little natural, like, fall. This is it. Side. Let me show y'all the back. I don't know. This one might be too short to show that. Where it lands in, y'all can see. Y'all can see, y'all can see. But yeah, so um, that's this one, the shorter style, which y'all know I said I don't particularly do the shorter styles. Um, from the little teensy tiny bit that I can see in my phone, I'm looking like what's going on. So I'm going to go in the bathroom and I'm going to get up and <laughs> look at it. Then I'm going to come back and tell y'all what I think because... See, this one is a glimpse I'm getting in the phone. I'm looking like, nah, sis, nah. But this is on the grown woman, too, though. This like the grown woman style, though. So, I can feel it. But, you know, I'm just saying it's not me. But we about to see. Okay, so, this one, what's it called? Boss Babe or something? What's it called? Oh, Elite Babe. This one is definitely giving me more of, like, auntie vibes you know what i mean like very mature very yeah very mature um you know which i am an auntie so maybe i need to start looking more like the auntie instead of the sister you know i can't help i look young <laughs> but uh -huh. so it is what i thought the bottoms the curls like they go every which way i don't like that um, that's why, you know, this kind of length, I normally don't like, but I tried it anyway, because I feel like it's just so random. Like, it's just, I don't know. Um, so I don't like that, but overall, it's a nice, it's a nice unit though. I mean, it's pretty. Um, I just don't know if it's me. And then they have like tried to cut layers in it or whatever, because it's like, this is going back, but then it's not like really super defined though, which is kind of. Loose and dangly, you know, but um, it's a little more lumpy, right? It's a, definitely a hump right here, so you're definitely gonna get have to, you know, pull out some heating tool to get it laying flat and good. But that um, part is excellent, hey, that part looks so good, though. Um, so yeah, what do y'all think? Let me know down in the comments. Um, if you like to see wig videos unboxing and trying them on and stuff like that uh definitely give this video a thumbs up if you like the units give it a thumbs up subscribe so you can continue to see the content i want to thank you all for tuning in dollars and cents online my name is ashley uh, i will see you all in my next video which will probably be a um haul for glasses because I ordered eight pairs of glasses so if you like fashion glasses you know you don't have to get a prescription or if you have a prescription and you like to look fashionable in your glasses just like I look fashionable with these more to come basically so if you like that then definitely um subscribe so you don't miss the video put that notification bell on sis put it on but yes thank you for tuning in I will see you all in the next one bye